Hi there, you've chosen to try mission number one, and this is our basic mission. Uh, what we're trying to get you to do is to log in and learn a few things about YouTube. Basically, uh, you can log in uh, with Gmail account. If you don't have a Gmail account, Aaron's instructions are right here, and you can watch those. So let's go ahead and log into YouTube. I'm already logged in as myself, um, and we'll look at some of the features here. One of the things you need to know is there's this drop-down menu up here, and this will take you directly to your channel. In your channel, you will see things like videos, which is basically a listing of all your videos that you've made. You have playlists, and your playlists are essentially how you choose to pile or file. I'm clearly a piler. As I watch YouTube videos, I save them to my favorites. And if I click on my favorites, I can see all of the videos I've favorited throughout my history of watching YouTube. Now, I like to make a pile because I'll use a uh, command search. I'll basically, I'll hit the Control F or the Command F button and then I can type in something, say for example like the word Prezi, and it'll search right to the videos that I've shared or curated relating to Prezi. And so this is how I choose to search, but not everybody does it that way. Some people like to name their playlists, and so you can create a new playlist by class, by content area, however you'd want. Channels are something a little bit different. Channels are something you subscribe to. So for example, you could subscribe to the Teaching Channel and watch their videos, or the Idea Channel from PBS and watch that those videos. I happen to subscribe to TED Talks. I subscribe to my boys who both produce videos on how to play video games. I subscribe to my wife's channel and to uh, channels like Teaching ESL, which is my field. But one of the key features in this mission that you're going to want to try is this upload button right here. And so this is when you get into actually making videos. And so in the upload button, you'll notice that you have the ability to, if you already have a video on your desktop, you can just upload it. And let's say something quickly about that. Videos can be uploaded as public, which means anybody can see them. They can be unlisted, which means they're uploaded but nobody can find them unless they actually have the link. Or they can be uploaded as private, which means you have to put in somebody's YouTube name for them to see it. Um, when you upload videos, you can do web captures right from your web camera. You can upload pictures to make a slideshow uh, and add music. You can do Google Hangouts, which is kind of like a Skype call with up to nine people that basically gets saved right to YouTube. We're going to start and your assignment is to make a web capture and so all you're going to do is click on the upload button and then click on web record. And so when you click on web record what it's going to do is it's going to actually turn on your web camera and when you click on the start recording button it's going to ask for permission to use your web camera. Once you've done that it's recording you. Hi there. And when you stop recording it's going to ask you to continue and it's going to actually start saving that up this is how it starts saving it and publishing it to your YouTube account. You can add a title, you can add a description, and then you can publish it. And once you do that, that video will be found in your channel. And so when you go to your videos channel, it'll be found there. And so here's one that Mandy and I did just the other day. All right, good luck on your mission.